sites breed uh, cr further violent crimes like robberies, shootings, prostitution, human trafficking. Um, you know, when you have that much cash on hand, it just breeds other violent crimes. And this is an investigation. It spans the entire state. So tonight we're now going to bring in Fox 4's Lise Chingiri, who spoke with the Gaming Commission as well as nearby businesses throughout this Wednesday to learn more. Elise. Chris and Nadine, obviously when you go out throughout areas here in southwest Florida, it's hard not to notice these arcades practically on every corner inside every shopping plaza. And we came across dozens today. We actually saw this sign were closed on this door here. You also notice this sign. The Florida Gaming Control Commission says they don't even recognize this because everything, the regulations only go through them. And back to this closed sign, you could possibly see more of these throughout our area as the Florida Gaming Control Commission says as they are cracking down on illegal arcades here in Southwest Florida. Another and another arcade. The Gaming Commission says they sent out multiple letters to arcades operating illegally. 70 letters throughout Charlotte County, four in Collier, and 59 letters sent to arcades in Lee County. And he told me this morning, no, no, you shut down for good. People we spoke with, including nearby businesses next to these arcades, like many, didn't realize just how many are operating illegally. I didn't know it was illegal. Here, I know it's not a not legal everywhere, but I didn't particularly know here. These things are in violation of Florida law, and they are also victimizing the public and taking advantage of them. And our goal is to uh, have them all closed. Florida Gaming Control Commission, also known as FGCC, is calling this a critical public safety issue. Director of Law Enforcement Carl Harold adding that since 2020, Florida has seen a significant increase in these illegal adult arcades. These sites breed uh, cr further violent crimes like robberies, shootings, prostitution, human trafficking. Um, you know, when you have that much cash on hand, it just breeds other violent crimes. To gather all the information to, uh, you know, to create a good enough criminal case for prosecution in court, it does take a while. You can't just walk in or, um, you know, do it over a couple of days. For successful prosecution, you have to collect a lot of information, and that takes time. Now, if you suspect illegal gambling activity, Florida Gaming Control Commission, they're asking for your help here in Southwest Florida. So, of course, this is Lee, Collier, and Charlotte County. They say if you notice any of that kind of activity, you need to report it to them. They said they check all reviews. You also need to call your local law enforcement. They say that way they can stop this illegal activity that's happening in our state of Florida. Live here in Lee County, Elise Chingari, Fox 4.